Hello, this is Lavender Lightworker. Uh, we're going to be doing a... I've been doing all 12 zodiac signs. I only have a few left. And I believe I'm going to do Libra today, right now. Um, Libra. Let's, let's clear the... Uh, This is for all placements. Um, check out your rising, your moon, your sun, your Venus, all of that to get a broader picture. Um, and even your north node. All right, and this reading is for February the 1st to the 15th. All right, we're going to leave that there since it wanted to fall out. Oh, I'm saying happy this is for Libra. February the 1st to February 15th, 2023. What does my Libra need to know? Let me make sure. So right away, we have... Uh, the the wounded warrior let's see what's going on show me what my laborers need to see okay I'm already seeing uh, a couple different messages. One is that you're protected and that um, there's going to be a decision made or you're going to have to make a decision to be quiet during conflict. Okay. You're going to be very confident and protected. Huh. You're going to be very confident and protected. Um, your spirit guides are, they got your back, Libra. Like, like you got to get through this guy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You got to get through that guy to get to you. Um, as far as this two of swords, I'm going to clarify this, but. I'm seeing that. Um. There's this, there was a decision that needs to be made or was made or was already made that missed an opportunity or was for the, it was for the best. Like there was a decision you had to make or someone has to make and you declined this opportunity or you need to decline this opportunity because if you were to take it, it was going to end up in all this conflict some type of business partnership or even if it, if if you were to have picked this say this love this new love um or a business listen by the way um not everything's going to resonate with everyone take what resonates leave what doesn't for someone else if nothing resonates click off and come back for a future video read but um and this is gender neutral, he, she, whatever. 
put it where it goes. This is a puzzle. This is your life. You put the pieces where it goes. This is for the collective. So I'm just reading and it's your job to put it where it goes, okay? But I'm seeing that um, you're protected. Um, your, your guardian angels um, are confident at protecting you and stopping something from coming through. And whatever decision this was, you had to make it blindly, or maybe you don't even know that it was being made on your behalf. Your your guardian angels might have blocked this opportunity that you thought possibly was. A, you're like, wait a minute, I really wanted that, but actually, it was for the it was for the highest good because um, it ended up it would have ended up in a bunch of drama. Um, conflict, uh, just uneasiness regarding a, a partnership, career partnership, a love partnership, a friendship of some sort. And then I'm seeing you're guided to be, to use your intuition and be very quiet as well. Do, do not, um, do, like move in silence. You, your intuition's going to kick off. You're going to get a download. Um, let me see more. Show me more. Yeah. You're, because, you, because of this entire situation here, your intuition's going to kick in. You're going to be quiet. And then... You're going to get this big, the biggest download of uh, clairvoyance, um, intuition, spirituality, and you're going to be filled with love. While all of this drama is happening, the opportunity that wasn't steady, this was not a steady opportunity. And you're going to be filled with self-love and you're going to stay quiet. I'm showing more, please. And really quickly um passionately and fast incoming work is coming in you're going to be you're going to be passionately working on something else that you actually love more um that's what i have for you libra that's beautiful um yeah because something was going to take a long time it it was it, it, yeah a long time it, it was gonna be kind of resting too long it's the truth that you weren't supposed to take that offer be about your money because you were better off not partnering and doing this alone single it was it it that's that was what the stars and the universe had planned for you yeah um you will, you will get your completion. And the like I said, I told you, the angels stepped in and blew a horn on it. Okay. So, before I close out, because this one went fast. Um, I just saw a random message about you having to walk away from your past. Uh, you, um, you've been like, something for your past. You've been holding on to and like um at some point they're like come on like don't make us take it from you like just the faster you get rid of something that doesn't serve you from your past especially during this full moon the faster something new can come in if it makes sense and, you know like this was something new that was going to come in but it, it manifested in a way that wasn't good for you but you were protected but you know, maybe your next spread I do will show things coming in good for you because you got rid of something. Your intuition is going to kick in and you're going to get something new that belongs to you because you're going to be working on yourself and releasing things that no longer serve you. Okay. But um, on another note, let's see. I want to know what was this Ace of Pentacles in reverse? Shall I please this Ace of Pentacles in reverse, please? Ace Pentacles in reverse, please, and thank you. Nine of Cups. Nine of 
cups and the ten of pentacles. So I have this ace of pentacles. It was something that was rejected um, or missed or it just wasn't meant to be. be and this decision was made, this, you were blindfolded. It was made by the ethers, by the ancestors, by the spirit guides because um, somebody was gonna be very greedy um, and not, they were, you know, you wanna get to the 10 of cups. And in this situation, this person was going this opportunity was only gonna, it was gonna hype you up to the nine, but you would, you'd be stuck. It was like a glass ceiling. You'd never get to the 10 and this person wasn't gonna budge or this opportunity wasn't gonna budge. It was gonna become very heavy and stressful. Um, and you know your worth. And at the end of the day, you're gonna have a better, you're, you're, you're better off on your own getting your pinnacle your time, money, and your energy. It was like a waste of time, money, and energy, period. And that's why it was denied. And at the at the ten at the bottom of the deck I have the ten. So, you know, boom. You're gonna get that either way, you know? Yeah, you're gonna celebrate new opportunities. You're not gonna be stressed over it because you chose to be alone. Yeah, you're gonna get your um your pinnacles. It's coming fast. You're gonna be emotionally stable. Yep, balance, fairness, karma. Like I said, judgment. And it's coming. It was. It was. It's coming fast because that, that um, that petty conflict that you avoided, because you avoided it, you have a brand new start, and now you're gonna manifest. Like I said, so that our next spread is you're gonna manifest re planning and releasing something that no longer serves you. You're gonna end it. Okay. That's what I have for you, um, Libra. It's pretty straightforward. Um, I don't even think I'm gonna ask for advice because I already told you the advice. You need to release something that no longer serves you. So you, um, even though the ancestors and the angels are protecting you and they have taken care of this situation behind your back without you knowing, I want you to know that um, I'm hoping the next time we read that um, you have released something that no longer serves you, person, place, thing, work, um, purge, purge thing, and see how it makes room in your life for things and watch all the miracles happen, okay? So I'm seeing, I saw some resistance here, but like I said, your guardian angels took care of it, but you need to start doing your own work. Yes, rely on them. But they want you to step into your own power, start working on um, taking action towards your intuition, okay? All right, that's what I have for you. And um, if you want a personal reading, look in the description box. All right, and please like and share and subscribe. Thank you.